wombenyin na mbenyin na afisu no besia na besia ho na wor ho nsema na na do dan kwa ku fa do gani ya mampenyin okakan e wo aja si rejuma zino adono oya sampenyin fu pepre a wo wo mani mu e na waka sazi etia sue fa enka no na ohwe asase ho nsam adu owa inu safu seni achemde ensem ana na do dan kwa ku fa do okan no se homosexuals a wo wo mani mu e ka kan won ho ka krebi eze chena entempa nara obeji benyi na benyi na besia na besia hon awar no oze atum ententa ma orichrem na na do dan kwa ku fa do nsem a okan no orichin da mon kwa fi hon adwen ejina do da wo beye bibi I think that this political miscommunication. You see, he spoke rightly as a person, as a lawyer, but he communicated wrongly as a politician. Because his, his predecessors had set the tempo. And that's why people are putting what he says against what his predecessors said. They said almost the same thing. Okay? But the communication, the content of the communication differs significantly. But he says it can't happen now. He doesn't see it happening. Basically, that was what President Mill said. I don't see it happening. Basically, that's what John Brahma said. I don't see it happening. Okay? But because he imported words to mean that, well, it can happen. Because it, it was not acceptable anywhere in this world. But it has happened in many places. And Ghana is part of the Committee of Nations. It might happen in Ghana. Because he imported those words. People are now holding him to those words as being tolerant. It, it cannot happen during the time of uh, uh, Nana Adadanko Akufado. It will not happen during the time of Nana And you are one of those who, who hold him as being tolerant. I, I, yes, I do. I do. You, you sincerely think that today, if there were to be civil society, you know, massing up and saying we want homosexuality, you know, as it were, decriminalized, quote unquote, he would, yeah, he would sign on to it, and that's because why, of what he has said. That's again why I think that he communicated wrongly politically. Again, people are looking at that statement as an invitation to treat. Okay, you are inviting, <laughs> you are inviting them to make the offer, <laughs> and, that, and that if they do. I mean, you are amenable because he's tolerant. So you must look at all the content. You must do a content analysis of what he has said. And then you come to the conclusion that, yes, I mean, he was a human rights lawyer. Okay. And mm. an avid one at that. I mean, mm. he, he, the case law is replete of, with cases he has defended okay. in court. So now, I think that we must let the international community understand that yes, we as a country are a very responsible member of the Committee of Nations. That yes, we have our customs and traditions. Yes, yes, those customs and traditions, because they are fluid, they continue changing. That at this time that we speak, it doesn't look likely that we will accept homosexuality as a way of life in our countries.